Hello everyone. I am Oz and in this video I am going to show you how to create stock submission sheets for Pond5, Shutterstock and Adobe stocks. Uh, it's the same for uh, most of the sites out there so this would work for pretty much all of them. So let's get started. So the first thing you would do is uh, the first thing I do is that I have these sample stock sheets and I copy them into the rendered stocks folder. So these are stocks that are rendered, they are named and now I'm creating the sheets for them. So the second thing I do is we copy the name and we go and we change the name of this one. one done which one more space and then the last one so yeah uh, it's okay if it's not dot c s v as well oh okay no need for that Okay, so once we've done this, what we do is we select all the files and say Command C or Control C, and then we open up the first one, which is Shutterstock. And uh, for me, it Open Office makes things easier and faster, so I recommend using Open Office for this. So you open Office. So once it pops up and open it in open office, you click here and say, okay. Then you have the sheet. So the first thing you do is command V. So you've got all the files here. Make sure you click this so that this is uh, aligned. Then you copy them again here, and then again, and then in this scenario, Control F, search for dot mp4, replace it with nothing, more selection, current selection only, replace all, close. So now you have the names, you have the file names. Now next we are going to work on the uh, the keywords so you can add up to 50 keywords and now I'll show you how we add keywords okay so because I know this project and you will know your project so this is more about the streets uh, in Karachi at a Sunday market you know it's about a market uh, so for that I would go to uh, the key keyword tools to go to keyword tools in Shutterstock Simply go to portfolio and keyword suggestion. Okay, so here say market. Let's search for uh, market in Pakistan. Okay, and I normally go for videos search okay so let's see what we find here so this this is a minute to the market busy market this so you click on clips that you feel are similar to the ones that you have and although it requires only uh, three but I tend to go for more so that I get more. So yeah, once you've clicked these, next up, you start adding the keywords. Pakistan, Karachi, cheap market, Karachi, handmade, traditional, small business, Asian,
traditional clothing crowded city bazaar busy open air market buying and selling street crowd okay so i think that's that's about it colorful can also so then we start going down and see what else we can add lifestyle uh, pakistani small shops buying clothes women clothes all karachi shoppers outdoors now that you have added all of these then you add in stuff that you know yourself that could go here for example Sunday Okay Okay so after you have these Normally, I tend to add in more. For example, you can add in culture as well. Let's say, whole sale. What else we can see from here? We'll see. Okay. Okay. So once you have these ready. I tend to go for at least like urban is good, public is good or so. Let's uh, go till uh, Muslim woman, street market, fruit seller, and then uh, okay, that boy is Hong Islam. Islam is okay or so. No, because it's a Muslim country in Asia, people. So now we have like about uh, 38 of these carpet and rugs, walking, tourism, in a way, and uh, travel. Okay, so we've got like about 42 here. So we copy these. We open our open office again and we paste them here. Okay. So after you've pasted them, you can add in more stuff like tan and like uh, wholesale, wholesale market, Sunday, Bazaar, famous market, Karachi market, for example. So normally I would add in, I will have like about 45 here and then according to the keywords here, on, on the names here, I would add two, three at the end, right at the end, which matches more with these, for example, let me just zoom it in, okay. So you can add in Afghan by barbecue. So this would be, for example, copy and I'm going to paste it on all of them till here and draw away okay so now for each one of these either at the end or in the start whichever works for you for example over here I will write I will add in Afghan barbecue Afghani. Okay, 
and so on and so forth that you keep adding a little bit of barbecue cooking Afghan kebab so you see oh this is similar so let's just copy that one that I made before and bring it here and paste it here so yeah it's replaced so this is how you keep adding uh, so you have like the 45 general uh, keywords that you take from the overall uh, shoot you know and then you have another five that you add in uh, to to add in more specific keywords like uh, shopkeeper Muslim stick you know women black at Sunday market uh, uh, Patan sitting at a stall at Sunday market uh, root shopper so you can say root shopper uh, juice you know a person preparing juice so you can see juice and it's an orange juice I think this one's an orange juice with a traditional machine so orange juice traditional machine uh, are two other things you can add in and so on and so forth so once you've done this let's go back to the normal view so once you've done this you have your your file name your description your keywords done next up you have the categories so you can add up to two categories in shutterstock uh, and uh, so so look to look at those categories we would go to here these are the categories of shutterstock you know uh, i normally take a screenshot and keep it with me uh, so this this is it you have to spell it exactly how it is you know so in this case it would be holidays and comma people or buildings and landmarks and holidays a few things it can be okay so we go back to our sheet and we say okay it's buildings and nature so not nature let's make this holidays and we would people okay comma space and then and exactly the same yeah and then after that you just copy this and you paste it all the way till the last one so I can uh, you press shift and click and then this selects all of them and there you go so again make sure you double click here so that it goes all the way out and uh, that helps in processing CSV files so the next category that we have is editorial this is not editorial uh, R rated no so we keep that at no sorry about this movement uh, let me just use this maybe this would be more helpful yeah and then we have the price uh, that's up to you I normally keep between somewhere between 50 to 80 I would recommend 70 at least uh, depends on the quality of the shots and what you have you know so again for this and then we have the city and the country so for this again we copy all of this Control Z, Control C from this edge to this edge, Control V. Okay, so now you have your sheet ready. Let me bring it back. Sheet is ready. You know, with all the columns. Okay, this is so small. <laughs> Anyways, so you just save it keep current format okay so after you've done with shutterstock the next one you will open is adobe and you copy this com command c that's the file name description and keywords only command c you go back and you open same click here okay So it's going to open this is the format for adobe and then you just click here and come on we so it this is already prepared for us the keywords double click here so it goes there and then we have the category and release we don't if you have a release it's with a model you say yes and then you add in your release when you're uploading uh, through ftp if no then no and then here you can add one category and which is by numbers so for this category and I'll put this out in the description so that you know what are the categories uh, for this you have 
these are the categories you know one is for animals two is for buildings and so on and so forth so in our case this one would be would could be 15 and 12 I, i'll go with highlights environment at work play so 12 12 is the category over here so we move back we say okay this one is 12 Notice that they don't have pricing, which is good because they do tend to get you good prices. And as you know, no release, so you copy all of that and all the way down here, paste. Okay. And then you just make sure that this is so aligned, you know, and save. After you've done this, again select from here till here command c and then just close this one and let's open our last sheet which is point five point five there you go again click here okay so with pond five you uh, you can see that the format is a little bit different so for that let me just so it has the the original file name the title description these and in that case you only had description in here you have the title as well so what you do here is that instead of starting from here you copy from here top command v everything comes here great click this so that it's a then keep this selected and sh keep shift pressed and click here so that you have this portion selected command c again and then come on v so now you can see that again align everything so let me just increase this a little bit so you can see so you can see that we have two columns which has the description which is the same description then we have uh, the original file name which has the mp4 we have the uh, the keywords copied and then the last but not least is the price now we're going to work on that so here we're keeping a price of 60 again that's up to you but uh, i recommend 60 for this one somewhere between 60 and 75 or 55 to 75 something like that uh, again if it's a really high quality 4k you can go above 100 or 150 as well so so that's about it you save this and we are good so this is how you uh, create uh, stock submission sheets for these three websites that's Shutterstock, Adobe Stock and Point5 and it's it's very much similar and this is how you look at the keywords and add the keywords to it as well and, and, and the naming format uh, and on how to do it faster as well. So yeah, so if you learn something from this, uh, please do smash the like. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.